if you feel that you're simply going through the motions today, if you feel flat, if you feel that life is a treadmill, if you feel that you're just drudging along, you need to wake up and start doing what you're doing wholeheartedly because I'll tell you this, everything that is done wholeheartedly, everything in which you immerse yourself, regardless of what it is, regardless of how boring you think it might be, regardless of how repetitive you think it might be, or how much hard work you think it might be, everything that is done wholeheartedly, everything that is done with an energy invested, is a step towards the life that is best for you, the life of your dreams. I always remember years ago, many years ago, I got it into my head before I even started working for myself, that I wanted to know how to program computers. I sat night after night after night, up to 11 or 12 o'clock each night at home, trying to teach myself to program. And eventually I did. I was a programmer in Visual Basic and I invented a piece of software, that a financial planning software, that unfortunately was a little ahead of its time, two or three years ahead of its time, and unfortunately our company was a little underfunded. And when we did get it funded, well then we got involved with venture capitalists and that's an entirely other story. We'll just park that over there. But I remember wondering sometimes on those late nights, what am I doing this for? But I remember being so committed, so engrossed, so immersed in what I was doing that an odd time, Lisa, my wife, would come in to me at one or two in the morning and say, you're coming to bed. And I'd still think it was about nine o'clock in the evening. I was so engrossed. And as you know, when you're enjoying yourself, time flies. I couldn't really figure out for years after that why I was doing what I had been doing all those nights. But now I know, with Gertie nearly two years old, that I simply would not have been able to create this website and be able to maintain this website and be able to get my message out to the wide world through this website had I not an intricate knowledge of computers and programming systems. Now, there are a number of other stories I could tell you in relation to other strange things that I've done along the way in relation to, for example, amateur filmmaking that has me sitting before you now and I'll edit this and produce this film afterwards. The point I'm making is that very often in our lives we find ourselves in a job that is drudgery. Very often we find ourselves doing something that appears at the time to be meaningless. But whatever you're doing, if you do it wholeheartedly, it is always, always, always a step in the right direction. It is always a step on the path towards the life that you really want. What's my point? My point is this. The only time and place that we can make an impact on our lives is here and now. It doesn't matter what you're doing here and now or what you're supposed to be doing here and now. If you do what you're doing here and now wholeheartedly, in other words more than the pathetic 1% that normal people put into what they're doing. If you do what you're doing wholeheartedly, it will inevitably take you in the direction that your heart desires, take you on the path to the achievement, the materialization of your perfect life. If you don't do what you're supposed to be doing 100% in the here and now, the only place and time where life is lived, then you're going to continue going around in circles. It's a vicious circle. It's more like a vortex because it will eventually suck you in and you'll end up dying, as I said to somebody recently, bitter and twisted, unfulfilled. Now is the time that you have to live your dream. It doesn't matter what you're doing. Now is the only place and time where life is lived. You better live it, because if you do, it'll take you to places that the normal mind could never even imagine.